is Dr. Long Vo. And who is Dr. Julie Dow? I believe they're with Smile Center Dental outside of Toronto in Burlington, Ontario. We did a terrific interview with both of them for our Dental Top Doc Legends program because of the innovative work in dentistry that these folks are doing up they there. They have some groundbreaking work. And you're about to see one of the questions and answers that we asked them during our interview series. And then at the end, we have a lot more for you, so you want to stay tuned all the way to the end. Special offer coming for you. A very special offer. Stay tuned. Do I need to floss my baby? And how is your answer different if the child has two teeth or 20 teeth? Uh, so flossing is uh, definitely important. You have to floss your, uh, your child's teeth. Get between yes. and get all that. Uh... So whether it's, it's only two or 20 teeth, it's, it's the same. Uh, we, the flossing reaches where the toothbrush cannot reach uh, and more important than that is the baby teeth are practice for the adult teeth mm. right so if um, so it's practice for, for the parents to take care of the baby's teeth but uh, also the baby will learn by feel how, how it's supposed to feel like when, when they're being flossed and then when their adult teeth come in and they're able to do it themselves then they know how it feels uh, and that way it, it, it's a lifelong skill and uh, absolutely we have to uh, remove that bacteria that doesn't belong there. So no matter how many teeth, yes. start flossing yes. now, get them in the habit of doing it, take away that bacteria, yes. dislocate the plaque. Yes. Okay. And just to be clear, I mean it may sound like a silly question but you know people have silly questions. Um, we talked about dental care before teeth show up, is there anything that you would do with floss before a tooth has erupted, or is that purely a treatment for a tooth? You you need the tooth to floss. To floss. You um, don't floss your gums. You may you may practice on yourself to be mm -hmm. <laughs> to be uh, skillful in using the floss, um, but the purpose of the floss is to reach where the, the toothbrush cannot. Between the teeth. Between the right. teeth. Um, with baby teeth, sometimes it's spaces, so it's probably more forgiving. Um, but some kids, um, like my children, all of their baby teeth were tight. So we had no choice. We absolutely had to floss. Otherwise, it, w it wouldn't be forgiving. They, they went up with a lot of cavities between their teeth. They wouldn't floss them. Um, but again, it's just um, you know, in instilling those good habits early on. Um, my daughter, what she likes to do, um, she likes to floss herself. She'll, she'll, we'll floss for her, but she'll take a piece of floss. Or if I'm flossing for her, she'll hold my fingers, <laughs> and she'll direct me into flossing her teeth. That's great. Um, so when I see that, um, it makes me very proud because I know that hopefully from now and on, um, flossing will always be part of mm -hmm. um, her, her oral hygiene habits. I guess it's a good sign if your daughter is <laughs> correcting the dentist on how to yeah. floss her own teeth. So that's a good sign. Good job well done. Oh, Dr. Mark, that's a good answer there to that question. That was terrific, but that's just the beginning. We have so much more to give you here. Where do we have more to give you here? DentalSecrets101.com DentalSecrets101.com What do we have there? There we have, hey, we have the entire interview that this was just one question from, but that's just the beginning. We have the Dental Secrets 101 special report. Oh, you do want to get that. That's a Absolutely. downloadable right away. You can get all these questions and answers, some new ones, some other information. Lots of information to take care of your dental health and the dental health of your family. But you're also going to get an ongoing newsletter with great tips for your dental health and taking care of your kids. But the interview is going to be terrific because it is just lots and lots of information with two dentists. And every time we add another series of these, we add it to the same thing. So you may find there's a lot more there than you even think is there. So if you liked this question and answer, now's the time to get even more. So click on that link that's down below, Dental Secrets 101, and get all of this plus so much more.